Hey everybody, Kyrie091 hanging out with you. Boy, oh boy, are we going to have big fun today playing some more Final Fantasy VII. I apologize for the long break, I know. I know that was an unreasonably long break. I get that, and I am sorry. Um, but we're back. And as I recall, when we last left off, what were we doing when we last left off? Hmm. Oh, that's right, we were in the Shinra building. Um, and we had just... Uh, seen that little, the little dog-looking fella in that glass tube there. And, uh, as I recall, we were gonna go up here. Hang on a second, I forgot my soda. I'll be right back, let me get soda. Boy, I am rusty, huh? Well, good news. Got the soda. Alright, let's go up here. So what's going on up here? Eris! There's Eris inside that glass tube. Outsiders. Should have noticed it earlier, you. <clears throat> so many frivolous things in this world. Are you going to kill me? I don't think you should. The equipment here is extremely delicate. Without me, who would operate it? Hmm? That is not your problem. Ugh. Think things out logically before you make any rash moves. Bring in the specimen. Well, I don't really care about his stupid, delicate equipment. There's Eris. Sample. Uh-oh. That red-orange thingy is gonna attack Eris. Cloud, help! What do you think you're doing? Lending a helping hand to an endangered species. Both of them on the brink of extinction. If I don't help, all these animals will disappear. So he wants... He wants that dog thing to, like, mate with Eris? Is that what this is? Barret's gonna do stuff. Stop! Do it anyways, Barret. Oh, he's shooting. He's just... He's just throwing away bullets. Oh, Hojo did not like that. My precious specimens. Ha! Oh, you're gonna mate with you now, Hojo. Now's our chance to get Eris. Let's get her. Thanks, Cloud. You're welcome. Glad I could help. Cloud, you should really get out of that thing, dude. There you go. What's wrong? Elevator is moving. No ordinary specimen, a very ferocious specimen. He's rather strong. I'll help you all out. What? It talked? I'll talk as much as you want later, miss. That dog thing can talk? Uh, Tifa, counting on you. You take Eris somewhere safe. Hojo has named me Red Thirteen, a meaning with a name with no meaning whatsoever to me. Call me whatever you wish. Well, we're gonna call you Red Thirteen. Well, good to meet you, Red Thirteen. All right. So what did I give up? I think I might have given up my my healing capabilities. Yeah. God damn it. Should have thought that through. Let's steal from this guy in the back. Nothing to steal. Alright, that's fine. Let's sense this guy in the back. Uh, red comes with the sense materia. Red 13 comes with sense materia. And sense materia is pretty cool. I'll show you all about it right now. Shady breath. I like poison red 13. Sense Materia tells you the remaining HP of a monster and their MP and any weak points they have. So now you see when I go to target him, I can see his HP. Down there, 927 is what he's got left. And we're not doing much damage with attacking him, so I guess we won't do that. Cast fire and everybody. Uh, cross slash guy in the back. Oh, Christ. Cloud, quit doing that. 
Alright, cross slash incoming. Smack. Boom. 160. And he's frozen. You can tell he because he's frozen and he's not moving. We're gonna heal cloud. I don't know why the town does this. I don't know why this game hates me. Kill this thing. Alright, that guy's no longer frozen. The one who was frozen by that cross slash. Which was cool. Oh, crap. That doesn't sound good. Rihanna magic. Oh, Jesus Christ. I should have known. I should have known something like that was going to happen. What the hell is wrong with me? How did I not, how did I not figure that? We're just going to nuke this guy. I'll just cast fire on him. That seems to be doing okay damage. <laughs> the music is making me mad. I don't know why it's doing that. Hang on a second, guys. Alright. Back to it. We might have to call it an early day after this fight, because uh, a young man, uh, he just woke up, and he's going to be in the background uh, needing stuff. So, rather than recording all of that, I think we will just finish up this fight and call this one of those really short episodes. I feel bad, because it's been like two weeks since I did an episode of this, maybe even longer, and like here I am, like, ending it right away. All right. I don't know when I'm even going to be able to save it, but I'll figure it out. Talisman! Alright. Hey, there's something in there. You alright? Alright, in many ways. Alright, just shoot. I don't like two-legged things. What are you? I am what you see. Let's get out of here. I'll lead the way. Acting to throw Hojo off guard. So Red was not going to try to hook up with Eris. That's good. Okay. I want to get that cure magic from Tifa. So I guess we can grab Tifa for a moment. I wonder if Eris has anything I want. I don't think she does. Menu. I think I could have accessed her magic. Like, yeah, you can access people's everyone's material like this by uh, pushing uh, going to the arrange thing here and you can go to exchange and you can access the material of people who aren't even with you so we could have just done it and you push triangle on to unequip it so we could have just got that from Tifa thus um, I think I want to bring I think I want to bring cloud Barrett and red is who I'm gonna use and if you don't like it well I'm not that worried about if you like it Store all. Listen, listen to that music, dude. You, how do you what? What is the deal with this music being so rad? Doo -doo -doo -doo. Um, and I should be able to cure now. There we go. Wasted plenty of potions, and I think we are set to go here. Okay, button. Be waiting at the 66th floor elevator. Okay. 66th floor elevator. There's um, something in here. Enemy skill! That's a cool one. Who can we give that to? Huh. Talisman does spirit plus 10. I want to give that to Cloud. I'm going to give this dumb thing to Barret. Protecting it. Oh, that's why Cloud never got poisoned in that fight. Because he had the thing on. Um, do I want to 
give him... Yes, I do want to give him the four slots, because I want him to have enemy skill material. Four slots, I actually have to lose some defense. Get a little bit of magic defense, but at least we get the enemies. We can now have room to add enemy skill material. Look how many stars that has. I don't think I've gone over this. I'll go over it real quick. You can see how um, the fire magic here says it has 318 AP, and it has 1682 till next level. Well, uh, after every fight, you gain a little bit of AP. So um, once we get 1,682 more AP with this uh, fire magic materia equipped, uh, it'll gain a level, and it'll learn fire 2. And then you'll see the uh, stars there, like there's only one star lit up. God, listen to that music getting all stupid. Uh, the next star will then light up, and um, once you light up all four of the stars, it'll master the fire magic, and you will also get another fire materia for mastering it. Like, it'll be a brand new one, though. Um, and that's how it is to level up magic, or to level up materia. The difference is with enemy skill, it has a whole bunch of stars, because you don't level it up with AP. You um, l illuminate those stars by learning different enemy skills, and we'll go over that once we get to it. It's actually really cool. Um, I think we should maybe look around a little bit before we... Potion, potion. The key card to the 68th floor? Why is he giving me that? I want to go up there now. Look at this spaceship thing. Alright. Well, I guess we can go to the 68th floor thingy over here. That's where we are, though, I think. Okay. Is there anything else we can do up here before we leave? Because I think we're about to, like, leave this building. Everyone's waiting at the 66th floor elevator. Okay. Well, we came here to rescue Eris, and we did that. So I guess it's time to go. Before we go to the 66th floor elevator, we're going to call it a day. I'm going to go save it. I think this is a new enemy here. Attack. Oh, Red 13 has a limit up, so let's try it out. Sled Fang. I'll try it on this guy in the back row, I guess. I don't know why. Look at Barrett's getting a lot of menu commands here, because I keep giving him all the command materials. We'll do a little bit more of a material lesson in this episode. God dang, the music is killing me when it does that. Big shot. You think you're such a big shot, Barrett? What with your big shot attack? Crack. I don't know. I like Red 13. I think he's pretty cool. Do you like Red 13? I'm asking you, audience participant guy. Or girl. Hopefully girl. Hopefully you're a girl. Um, Red 13. What do you think of Red 13? Alright, material lesson in session. So there are five different types of materia. Uh, there are these green ones, which are magic materia, and they just give you various spells. There are yellow ones, like this, which are called command materia. They give you different commands to use in combat, like steel and sense and enemy skill. Uh, there are these um, blue materia, the light blue here, that these um, these impact things that they're paired with. So like all materia, it'll impact whatever it's paired with, in this case fire. And here all is paired with fire, and all is paired with restore, so lets you cast an all. I think we've gone over that, but I don't think I told you. And then there's the purple materia, which... Um, gives your character, like, different attributes, I guess. Like, this one makes Cloud cover, you know, like, makes him, like, Cloud cover. Makes him jump in front of uh, allies who are getting attacked. Um, but there's other ones that do, uh, do things like give you more HP. Um, there's all kinds of different, like, uh, I think these are called support. I'm not sure what the exact name is. And then there's one other type of materia that we don't have yet. Oops, didn't mean to take that off. There's one other type of materia that we don't have yet. We'll go over it when we get it. I'm gonna go in here and mess with this guy. What's up, dude? Alright, we're gonna go up to here and we're gonna save it. At this very same save point. Hopefully we get another episode done before, you know, another two weeks. Oh, Christ, we only have one tent. 
I think we better use it. It kind of bugs me that it doesn't play a little song when you use um, a tent anymore. In the other Final Fantasy games, before this one, uh, it, plays a little, it plays a different song depending on what game you're playing. Anyways, guys, that's going to do it for this episode of Let's Play Final Fantasy VII. Uh, like I said, hopefully we get another episode done sooner rather than later. But until then, uh, this is Kyrie 91 wishing you a wonderful day. All right. Yeah.